hi guys welcome back to the channel my name is brenda so guys today i'm going to show you how i made this beautiful top yeah i really love the outcome results yeah it came out so good it's all so wow so guys if you really want to learn how to make this please stay tuned let's go straight into the video Staring at herself in the mirror on the restroom door Voices in her head that mirror what she's heard before So guys, I'm having a one yard fabric. It's one I'm going to be using. Yeah, it's the one I'm going to be using. So guys, this top is very simple. It's very, very simple to make. It's very friendly for the beginners. Everyone can make this. So guys, I'm going to start by unfolding my fabric. Yeah, in that you see what I'm going to be doing. And I'm going to fold it in two four. Yeah, like that. So guys, after folding it, I'm going. I'm now putting in my measurements. I've started by the by with the shoulder line shoulder line measurement with is 7.5 and i'm putting in my sleeves the sleeves it depends on how wide long you want your sleeves to be if i told you want them to be short or long it depends but me i'm marking 12 inches for my sleeves from where i marked my 7 7.5 so now i'm marking my neckline now i'm marking 3.5 and the depth of it is three inches. So after that, I'm now measuring 10 inches for my bust line. Yeah, 10 inches. like that then my height my height is 23 by the time of i've done stitching it will be 21 yeah i didn't want it to be too too short i didn't want to show my body so that's why i've made that height but still if you want it to be too short on you you can make any height that you want yeah So guys, my sleeves are also 10 inches, yeah. I'm now going to divide my bust line by 2 inch by 2, yeah. Not by 4, but by 2. The measurements that you get are the ones that you mark on your fabric. So what I got is what I'm now marking on my fabric. Actually, I don't know what I was doing there, but <laughs> So guys, I'm going to do this the I'm going to put the same measurement at the 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 down part. Yeah, I'm going to put the same measurement. So guys, I'm going to put a little bit of a curve at my sleeve, at the beginning of my sleeves. Then I'm going to like that. Hope you've seen how I've made it. There is a little bit of a curve at the end of my sleeves. So guys, that's all that you need to mark on, on this top. We're going to cut it out. You can see how easy it is. Yeah, you can see how easy it is. So 
so guys after i've opened up my top this is how the work is i'm now marking two inches on my one side of a of a neckline i'm marking two inches now i'm going to make a curve up to where i've marked my two inches since my neck is round so i have to make a round shape up to the two inches that i've marked like that but still if you want you you you, you want it to be too open you can make like three inches two and a half but me i wanted it to be two inches i didn't want it to be too open on me yeah So guys that's how it looks like after cutting one the one side yeah that's how it looks like now i'm going to put a hem since i'm going to use a lining i'm going to put a hem on my neckline yeah i'm going to put a hem And I'm going to join. Um, I'll just just I was just illustrating what I was going to do. Yeah, joining all the sides, putting elastics. So guys, I've done hemming my my neck. You can see how neat it is. Now I'm going to join my sides, both sides. I'm going to join them. Then I'm I'm also going to put in elastic on my sleeves. Yeah, I'm going to put in elastics. So guys after putting on elastics that's how it looks like yeah that's how it looks like then i'm going to put the same elastic on my down part yeah i'm mega i'm going to i folded one inch yeah i folded one inch since the elastic i was having was small yeah So guys, I hope you've enjoyed this video. I hope you've had fun and you've learned something out of it. Please leave something in the comment section so that I know your suggestions. And please leave anything that you want me to do. Yeah, in my next video, I'll do it. Yeah, you guys, thank you for watching. And if you're new to my channel, consider subscribing share and like the videos plus viewing all the my previous videos yeah thank you so much for watching yeah thank you so much and for my returning viewers i thank you so much for always coming back thank you for the support thank you for the love i really appreciate it so guys you can see my end results this top is really amazing you can design it in any way that you want it's so 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 beautiful yeah you can see it's so so beautiful thank you so much